my people good morning good morning how do you do i'm doing so great today i'm doing awesome i'm doing marvelous i'm doing i forgot the other way <laughs> but i'm doing great i hope you're also doing great let me switch off the machine it's making noise done so welcome back to my channel my name is caroline Changa and to all my returning subscribers welcome back my people and if you are new here i hope you subscribe i hope you do the right thing and so that you can join the family but um today is a saturday uh, the time is around 11 a.m and we are doing a vlog <laughs> we're doing a vlog i'm not sure if it's gonna be a weekly vlog or a saturday vlog or a weekend vlog but i just know that we are vlogging <laughs> so we're gonna be vlogging um starting today um what's happening oh so um the plan today is to we are planning to go to the thingy what is that <clears throat> yeah. Let me close my door. So, having to go to um, the outlet store uh, for at home, I'm still on my coffee table hand and uh, i'm hoping i'll get the coffee table that i've been eyeing why can't so i was saying i'm hoping i'll get the coffee table that i've been eyeing um at a lesser price that is my hope so we're gonna go and check that and after that uh what's what's happening Oh, we need a vacuum cleaner. So we're in a shop. We are in hunt for a vacuum cleaner. So we're gonna check that uh, maybe at Marco and Baldus as well, just so we know, um, just so we can compare the price and if we get something, we'll buy it. Then the normal <laughs> weekend, the normal um, weekly groceries. I don't think it's the normal weekly grocery, but I'm supposed to go and do groceries later on. So, yeah that's just about it and we'll see how the rest of the day um goes so i hope you enjoyed this vlog i hope you enjoyed this video and you stay tuned so i'll see you guys on the street bye i've been missing the way you touch me baby Kisses on my neck and the love you gave me mm -hmm. When I think about it, I go a little bit crazy It's gotta be more than this For you and I to coexist Help me I wanna be more than just a friend I'm looking for closure So baby, pull me closer Scrolling through the text messages you sent me Trying to fill the holes where you left me empty eh, And when I think about it, get a little emotional Knowing that we might never ever be close to loving Help me I wanna be more than just a friend I'm looking for closure So baby, pull me closer Help me I don't wanna be just the one I stand I'm looking for closure So baby, pull me closer Help me I wanna be more than just a friend I'm looking for closure so baby, pull me closer Help me I don't wanna be just a 
one night stand I'm looking for closure So baby, pull me closer Sober up Think it's time for me to sober up Cause I don't know what I should do with all these feelings Don't wanna be needy Too in love Maybe I am just too in love Baby, all I know is I can't make you stay But don't just walk away just walk Help away. me I wanna be more than just a friend I'm looking for closure So baby, pull me closer Oh my word, I felt so much in love with these drawers and they looked so stunning. And really, I didn't see anything wrong, especially with this one. I didn't see really damage on this. So yeah, guys, this is, a, this is definitely a place to check out. Yo, so guys, I thought I've seen enough until I decided to go to this outlet that is next to at home as well, Cory Craft. Yo, guys, the things in there were so stunning. So this is the mirrors that I saw. I couldn't take, I couldn't get the prices for everything, but I'm sure if you are going into the store and looking for a mirror, they can actually tell you the prices for the mirror. So most of the mirrors were 30% off the total price and I've already like eyed beautiful mirrors there that could fit my living room. So yeah, this was also another catch.
beautiful people please don't mind yeah guys i'm sorry please don't mind my face don't mind me i just woke up i was i've been sleeping in the car there was like traffic in the highway it took us about one hour 30 minutes to get here and it's just 20 minutes drive so yo guys please don't mind me and i'm sorry to come on camera like this but i just felt like i need to update you because by the time i'll go and do the other stuff it will have been after a long time pull my seat up as well so it's been what i don't know what time is it honestly i think it's two i don't know but just a quick update so we went to at home clearance store and wanted to check um the coffee table right and i was searching for that um i got i saw one um coffee table that i think it will fit in in the house oh my man is coming but what was happening is we ended up getting um we ended up getting a bed <laughs> instead of a, a coffee table so let's go I am finished on the street. Let's go, my baby. Now you're also late to do your own things. Selling a teaspoon. Selling a teaspoon. So we went to at home clearing store. I was looking for a coffee table. So one nice coffee table, but I saw um something more interesting of which it was a let me take off my bag. So instead of taking the coffee table, I just decided let's get a new bed <laughs> well not new you but uh because it's a clearance store but we managed to to get a bed and it's a bed that i've been eyeing for a long time so i'm so excited you yeah, i'm so excited guys about that purchase i don't want to lie i'm already planning in my head um how am i gonna place everything in our bedroom but so excited so we by our place now we were just dropping the bed and i'll share the bed i don't know when will i share the bed with you guys because i actually want to do a um, mini bedroom tour after i've set up the whole thing so i think that is just gonna be after weeks i'm not sure we'll see how does that go so yeah, we just dropped the bed and now we have in eight Kabang. And I was thinking that actually you forgot to buy food before the store because we we're supposed to pass by, get something to eat and go to the stores because it's easier that way. So we didn't do that, but um there's still time. So we're just gonna go grab something to eat. And I feel like I'm catching um colds because um my jaw is so painful, it's so sore. So we're gonna get something to eat quickly. Then I'm gonna go and do groceries, and I think I'll come back to the house because I'm honestly feeling. Because honestly, my jaw, like I, I am actually burning here. So my person is gonna go and get medication for me in the house because actually he was the one who was um, not feeling well the whole week um he had flu so i think i took that from him so now i hope 
I don't get to a state whereby I'm saying, yo, I hope I don't get to that. But yeah, let's go and do groceries and I'll see you later. Peace. It's not my fault You've been lying saying that I took away your peace Drowning by yourself, now you wanna blame me Like you have no options I ain't take your options Now I'm not the problem Man, that's on you You've been terrorizing me, yeah, I'm always wrong. wrong I knew you lost your mind when you dropped that bomb wrong. Girl, are you crazy? Ooh. Yeah, you must be crazy Ooh. I've been thinking lately Lately it's you You stole your peace, put it on me Maybe it's you Lying like a rat But take your stuff back Maybe it's you 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 You, 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 you. Maybe it's you And I would never hear You've been flexing everywhere Girl, look in the mirror Man, you're so dirty Yeah, you look so dirty You were never worthy Lately, it's you You stole your peace Put it on me But baby, it's Lying like a rat, but take your stuff back, baby. It's you, 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 baby. It's you, 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 If I control the weather, then every day would rain on your 
parade Shine, you can't shed face, yeah If I was for the time Then I would change the day So I never saw your face It's not my fault You've been lying, saying that I took away your peace Drowning by yourself, now you wanna blame me Like you have no options I ain't take your options Now I'm not the problem Man, that's on you, yeah You've been terrorizing me, yeah, I'm always wrong I knew you lost your mind when you dropped that bomb Hi guys, um, is it a good morning? No, it's afternoon. Hi guys, uh, today it's a, um, it's a Sunday afternoon. I think I last time, last time, I last spoke to you guys on um, was it yesterday? It was yesterday before the groceries. So, so yesterday I went and like I said that we're supposed to go and do groceries. So by the time I was done, because if I'm not mistaken, I came back to the house around, I think it was around seven, seven after seven or so. So yeah, it just got too hectic yesterday. And by the time I came, I just wanted to unpack the grocery and rest. So yeah, please excuse me for my voice. Um, the colds and flu, but anyway, I hope I'll be better. Oh, so I also went and um, bought toiletries, right? So when I was paying by the till, this guy said, um, we're running a promo of what with vitamin water. So I want to show you guys that. I want to share that with you. Mind you, I didn't um, try them out. I think it's tablets. So I'm still going to see if are they working for me or not because he was saying they work like mid lemon. But when I came back to the house, <laughs> he gave my person to read them. What do you call that? That small paper that normally comes with medication. <laughs> what do you call that? I don't know, but that paper. So it's written that it's for energy boost and anti-stress. There's no way it's written that it's like mid lemon. Oh wait, but I don't know what vitamin does mid lemon has. So he might be right, but anyway. Um, so I have it with me. And this is, these are the tablets. I think are tablets. So it's written Super B, Energy, and Anti-Stress. <laughs> when I say Super B, I'm actually thinking about the Maisie Mel. <laughs> but anyway, it's saying Super B, Energy, and Anti-Stress. Né? Very high in B vitamins. And also it says 10 Fizzy Tablet. How do you open this? Because right now I'm thinking about using my teeth. <laughs> yeah, man. Okay. There we go. There we go. So, yeah. Uh. 
This thing they smell like clinic. Okay, they don't smell nice, but those are the tablets. I'm not sure if you can see. Just gonna take one because I'm about to drink it anyway. So these are the tablets. I think you dissolve it in water. More like when you are drinking those flipping, what do you call those? Codex and stuff. So I think I'm just gonna take this and I'll dissolve it. So guys, um, literally today update, there's no much that happened. So after church, after church, um, went and I finished doing Yo, my camera is taking taking. So I was saying, after church, you went to do groceries. No, was it groceries? Yeah, it was just basically buying things that I couldn't get yesterday. So I went and did that and came back to the house. I have committed myself that I will cook today. So I don't know, I'm not sure how would that go because electricity is about to switch off like in less than 30 minutes. So why are you making noise, Kent? So before the low shading, I wanted to organize my fridge or clean my fridge with you guys. Then I don't think I'll cook with you honestly. Um since well my energy levels i don't think it's my energy levels i think it's just the flu so i might not cook might not cook out see how does that go but i wanted to um clean the fridge with you guys and pack my things nicely because at this moment this person is making noise at this point in the moment um i just bought things and threw it in my fridge i didn't really pack so I wanna pick that nicely with you guys. Then yeah, we'll see. How does the day go? So for now, peace. Yo, when I'm saying for now, <laughs> I sound like a man. <laughs> Can my voice come back? Can my normal voice come back? I don't like this tone. Anyway, um let's um clean the fridge together, guys. I'm sorry guys i forgot to show you to share with you my the things that i bought yesterday i got from pebble home how did i forget that because that is um something that i was actually looking forward to share with you guys <laughs> so i almost thought the vlog without unboxing with you guys so let me quickly do that time it's really not on my side because i have 20 minutes to do everything to clean the fridge and to do the unbox so let's try to do that quickly. <clears throat> so I went to Pep Home yesterday. Also went to Mr. Price home. I'm gonna start with the smaller and plastic one. Right? So I got I hope it shows. I got this diffuser. I'm so excited about it because um, I think I've vented to you guys that um, most diffusers that I buy in this house, they don't, like, they're just quiet. They're silent. So when I, I smelled this, I was, like, really impressed. So I hope it's going to um, last longer because I also bought it for the... I bought it for the launch area. So... Yeah, I'm excited about the purchase. So this is how it looks. It, it's called Midnight Bloom. Um, the diffuser, 200 millimeter. Then I got it for 1999.99. <laughs> I'm joking guys, I got it for 200 rands. Uh, I'm not sure if you can see that. But yeah, I'm really excited about this purchase. So let's quickly open it. Am I gonna be able to wash the fridge though? I don't know. 
We made up head. Guys, I need to do my nails. I don't remember like the last time I was a lady. I need to go back to being a proper lady. So, um, it comes with these things as well. Last time I called them sticks. So, this time I'm not going to say <laughs> what is it. But it comes with those things. <laughs> so, let me take out the bottle first. Ooh! The bottle looks pretty actually. Come on. This is how it looks. But I thought there's like some name or something. So it's plain. I don't mind that actually because I think I'm gonna reuse this bottle instead of getting like a new bottle. I'll just get it on if I like the diffuser. So those are the sticks and yo, it smells amazing guys. I don't want to lie. It's, I think it's my first time buying a diffuser from Mr. Price. Quickly, quickly, please. I'm trying to take out the... Woo! The sticks actually have a smell as well. But they are not straight, right? They are not straight. So I'm just going to put all of them like... Oh no! I forgot the gold thingy. Why did I do that? I forgot to put the gold thing. So I'm just gonna put like that. Woo! Yes! <laughs> Yo, I'm running out of time. My second purchase from uh, Mr. Price Home. It was this dispenser. It's a soap dispenser. Oh my god. Am I not in love? I am in love. <laughs> Actually. I got those soap dispenser. I've been looking for soap dispensers now. Um, I think it's been like months now. Those things, guys. Yo, guys, I love this. So I've already unboxed this because I needed to match the color. <laughs> So I think I'm gonna go and buy the second one. But this is how it looks. It's so nice, it's so pretty. And this is ceramic as well. That's what I like because most of the thing, most of the time when I would see them, they will be like plastic. So I like that this is ceramic. Then this is um, plastic, right? So um, it goes for 109.99. So that is 110. I hope you can see. So it goes for that price. I'm really happy about that purchase. That's one thing for sure. Peek, peek. That was all that I got from the surprise home. Pep home, I got um, this glass jar for $69.99. So I think this is the la longest um, jar that they have because I wanted to get this for the spaghetti. I'm happy about this. I got... <laughs> So the other Sunday, guys, I was actually um, cooking mashed potatoes for supper. And the struggle, because I had to mash with my wooden spoon and it was not working. And I don't normally cook like mashed potatoes, right? But it's that Sunday that I realized that I don't have a... Is it a measure or a smash? <laughs> a measure. I don't have a measure. So I got myself a measure. It... Um, the gray goes with my other ba baking tools, right? The color, it's gray as well. So I got this for $36.99. There you go. I got this, um, I don't know what do you call it, but, oh, it's called cylinder holders. So I'm gonna use this. I think this is for <clears throat> cotton pads the cotton pads is because my cotton pads i was actually using them from the actual um plastic actual package so this i'm gonna use for no i think this is for cotton pads because i can just easily take them from there then this is for <laughs> the 
this is for earbuds guys i'm gonna use that for earbuds if it's not for earbuds i bought another jar right i'm gonna use it i'm to come back bona to go is to see really to go is to see the other day i bought <laughs> i bought rask right um and i was filming i needed to film that part of my day that part right and i realized that i, I don't have a rask jar so i've learned i went and got this it's a jar but guys i'm not really sure hey this thing looks small for like rask so i'm not sure if i'm gonna use this for it says cookie jar okay but anyway it's 32.99 there you go i think i must be straight to the point now because i'm running out of time so this is how you open it but my question is i'm not sure if i'm gonna store rask here am i gonna be able to pick them out because it looks small like really this thing it looks small but I would see if um, I will use that for all. So I got two of those. The other one, I specifically want to use it for a washing powder. So the other item, guys, that I need you to help me decide, right? But I'll probably see this before I return, if I do return. I bought this soap dispenser initially before the Mr. Price one, right? But I was not sure about the marble thingy. It's also ceramic, right? But I don't like the silver thingy going on here. I'm not a silver person. So I'm not sure if should I retain this and get another glass jar or what must I do because I'm really not sure where is this thing going to fit. Or unless maybe... No, but do I want it in the kitchen? Do you think, guys, I should put this thing in the kitchen and get another one to put um, the dishwasher? I'm not sure if I should use that, use this for that, or what must I do? I'm not sure. But guys, that is all that I got, and yeah. Um, let's do the things that we said we'll do.
I am so I'm so not okay. I'm honestly not okay. What? Yo! I literally felt like crying. I'm not okay. Okay. I need to calm myself down. I need to calm myself down. I am not okay. So guys, you know what happened? I can't believe this just happened. Yo, okay. I think my whole mood just went from 150 to minus 50 because so the electricity went off i shared with you guys right that the electricity is gonna go off at four right sharp um it went off i was still taking um i was still cleaning the fridge with you guys i didn't finish that okay cool i finished off camera because i didn't have lighting of course obviously i didn't have lighting um i finished up everything then now the electricity just came back right Sharp, I'm setting up my light because I want to show you guys that what I did in the fridge, right? That I finished off. What I did in the fridge that I finished off offline, off camera, right? I'm setting up my camera, I'm setting up my light, and I just started cooking as well. So I put some pasta there in the pot. So me living there, I'm leaving the tripod stand here with the light here, right? I'm rushing to take off the lid from the pasta, from the stove, right? Because um, it was doing the thing where it's spilling over. So while I'm rushing that, just a second, my tripod, my light, boom, just fell on the ground, on the time. I could feel I could literally feel the fall right through my heart so as we're speaking now I'm filming with a broken light if I get up if I gather some strength I'll take a picture and show you guys but literally my light has it's broken my light is broken Yo, I don't know, like, my own pants, my own pants, I don't know, my own pants. And I was really looking forward to show you guys what I did, what I'm up to. But I can still try. But I'm not okay. I don't want to lie. Yeah, anyway, let me show you guys what I did in the fridge. So I finished packing on the in the fridge because I had already took the stuff out. So the electricity was gonna come back two hours, 30 minutes later. So I just thought, let me just finish that and I'll show you guys what I did. So this is basically what I did. Let me bring you guys closer. Right. So I obviously finished off camera. So I packed the top part there. Um, the tray there, it's basically sauces that I um, sometimes need. It's basically sauces. Then going down, I've put, um, so it's just mixed. It's um, veggies and fruits and my eggs there. I've arranged them nicely there on the tray. And I've packed my apples as well, nicely there. Then um, the second, if I should take you lower or what, what, what must I do? The second thingy, um, those are just lemons, some strawberries, evo. So I think I need to get um, extra two of this so that those things they will be also in the tray you are making noise 
<clears throat> so it's that um here it's just veggies um for salads then here pack nicely there um veggies again <coughs> and then the drinks there so to show you guys so i've put um some what do you call um what do you call that it's hand wash then the thing that i got from um pack home so i've organized my cotton pads there but the earbuds are not fitting imagine <laughs> The earbuds they do not fit, but yeah, that is what basically I did. Let's see why well, they did now. Then that is the soap dispenser. Yeah, so that is what I did, guys. So I've packed my spaghetti there in that um, what do you call the large jar? Then packed my pasta, mostly oats, and that jar actually worked, eh? I'm just not sure if is it gonna work for rask now, but for now, I've put in cheese cookies, um, and it looks fine to me. So that is um, basically my corner there. So, what did I want to say? So yeah, well, no, I wanted to say that eventually I need to add um, this jizz. Then I'm just gonna do a pantry. I'm just gonna do a pantry um, for all of this instead of them being here um, in front of the public, in front of the people. So I'm just gonna take everything inside the pantry when <laughs> I am more organized. But I'm trying, I think I'm trying. And this is something so um this is the pasta that broke my my light wow twice um yeah yeah that's not good that's moving right along i'm gonna cook um what is this pork neck so i want to make mac and cheese right i've been craving for that so i'm just gonna make that and make strips here and fry it then that's gonna be them so guys i'm not sure if i'm showing but that is basically that i'm sorry guys i'm not gonna be able to cook with you i need to I need to calm down and besides i think this my footage is just too long now so i'm just gonna end Woo! i think i have trauma i think i have tra oh my god i think i have trauma yo um uh, my people let me not bring you into my problems <laughs> But um, this is a a put a put apricot fruit roll. I've been eating this for three weeks now. Um, I think because I was trying to um, stay away from sugar, so I was limiting my sugar portions as much as possible. So what did I want to say? Oh, I wanted to say bye, guys. So, I hope you enjoyed this video um, with our problems. <laughs> but I hope you really do enjoy this video. And if I don't close this vlog today, no, I think I should close it today because there's just really a lot that is happening. So, until I see you next time, my people. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I think I've repeated that five times already. I love you. Please take care. Don't um, don't break your lights. <laughs> Please.
please take care until i see you next time